Dam Art and a very special day in the company's Silver Jubilee year. Royal Highness, the Princess of Wales is in Bingley, West Yorkshire to visit the Damart headquarters. Today, the Princess is to meet the people behind the famous products. A proud occasion for managing director Ken Mullins, his wife Moira and his four-year-old granddaughter Lauren. The customer service department occupies the sixth floor. Each week, around seven and a half thousand telephone calls are received. Floor manager is Malcolm Higson. She made me feel totally at ease uh, and showed a lot of interest in what our customers' uh, complaints were, queries were, uh, and what type of merchandise they were ordering from us. Not even a royal visit halts the flow of telephone orders. I was very upset because I wanted to speak to her so much. But um, fortunately, I had the customer, which was at most an inconvenient time, and I had to take the call. Many others, though, were obviously delighted with unscheduled and most informal conversations. The fifth floor staff sort and process more than a ton of mail every week. Floor manager Stephen Stubbs explained that volume of orders in real terms. We do anything from sort of uh, 20,000 orders a day up to 40,000 to 50,000 orders a week. When she came through the door, she seemed um, a bit taken aback by the, the vast amount of space and the number of people we had. But um, she talked to a few people and, um, and myself and uh, she seemed to really enjoy it. One floor further down, the creative talents of the garment and catalogue designers. Marketing director Martin Smith, the Royal Guide. We set out the creative process that we do in producing the catalogues and producing the garments. We so realise that um, many of the functions she attends and many of the visits she does can't be directly interesting for her, but because we're involved with fashion and design, we were able to demonstrate a good part of that today. The princess was given a glimpse of a new outerwear range. I'm really enthusiastic. It's a new range of products from Damart, and I, I believe totally in them. I've tried them all. They work wonderfully, and I really want our customers also to appreciate them. Coordination of garment and catalogue design was explained. I was telling you how we uh, translate the um, brief sheets that we get from the merchandisers into the um, line drawing form which is uh, where the photographer gets his information from. Dam Art's recently launched collection of thermal underwear designed by Juliet Dunn. This is definitely the 1990s with the high cut leg and a much more flattering line. I mean, things have changed in the underwear business. Nobody really wants to wear knickers anymore. Knickers are out and they want to wear bodies.
the new collection apparently intrigued the royal visitor, but her true feelings were skillfully kept secret from the phalanx of photographers. It's also very good. Were there any fears that the royal transport between floors, the lift, would not work? No, because up on the seventh floor, I had a lift engineer <laughs> stationed up there all the time. This morning we had a little, a little rehearsal, so um, it had quite a good testing. Safely back on the ground floor, the princess, as patron of Dr. Bernardo's, was presented with a dam art check for £5,000 to launch a customer appeal. That wasn't all the Princess of Wales received. <coughs> After a tour of the mill shop, there were special gifts for her two young sons. <laughs> we think retailing should be a bit of fun, and uh, Pat's idea was that in view of uh, Prince Harry's birthday this coming Sunday, that uh, he might appreciate a little bit of a fun present. So we actually have some fun animal slippers there and we selected a pair for him and uh, not to leave his elder brother out a pair for him too. Everybody was looking forward to it. I told them they should enjoy it. I think they did. I saw. Damart are a wonderful employer, and what pleases me is that they have done it and continue to employ more and more of my constituents, and they've increased the range. You know, at one time they were seen as being just uh, limited in that sense, and I'm thrilled that during this period of difficulty, if we can call it recession, they really have done wonderfully. The views of Sir Marcus Fox, constituency member of parliament for more than 20 years. It's a lovely thing for the Princess of Wales to visit Denmark today. And the thing is she seems so interested about everything. And she really is the perfect lady.